So I returned here to do a leak search. Threw my gauges on. My pressure is only almost non-existent. So I don't see oil here anywhere inside this condenser. So I'm gonna have to do is turn it on. Add just a trace charge, whatever's in that can, there's almost nothing left, but just enough so that I can use my electronic sniffer to try to find where this leak is in here. I reset power, that's why I'm not flashing. I had an open circuit fault. And last time I probably added like five or six pounds into here. And this whole thing for here is seven pounds, 13 ounces. And we got about a 40 foot line set. All right, so let's turn this thing on see what kind of pressure we have I'm just gonna add more of a trace charge because that can's practically empty so there's like nothing in it so it's only like one pound I'm putting in but I need to know what's in my unit don't do this unless you know what you're doing big controversy in one of my videos once about me doing this that my pressures are almost even. Let me close that. Not good to be just moving gas through the unit. Bum, 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 bum. Uh oh, okay, pressure's almost even. It's anyway. That's better. Suction's coming down. And head is going up very little. Nitro connected. Alright, so that's connected. On. Let's drive this in a little so I can get some pressure. Okay, some pressure I got going on there. And let's bump the system. Raise it. Okay, let's see what we got. I think it's about 200. Be able to use my leak tech, my electronic. Now the system's gonna need a vacuum anyway because I can't recharge it. It went flat. Wait a second. Doesn't seem to hold at all. Comes down rather quickly. Here's what it looks like. You get chainsaws, you get everything. You got this guy with his leaf blower. He's probably raked. He can't move the friggin' leaks anyway. But. quickly but you can see so that's 270 right now 270 he's going up a little and him but as it warms up that's the problem having refrigerant it's gonna move 
I hear something. What the hell am I hearing? Nothing, no pipings in there. It's all right here. Yep, and what do I see? Look at that. From the rainwater. Oh, looks like we got a leak here. Let's get the sniffer. Find out what's going on. I spray some bubbles, but I don't want it to get in the way. Hey, that guy's bubbling away. I thought I heard something bubbling and making a weird noise. We had a hurricane last night, so... Can't even hear if this is on. It's so friggin' noisy. Here we go. Takes forever to heat it up. I mean, yep. Didn't go up over here. Oh, look, I'm seeing even a white mist coming off. The refrigerant. Yep. So I got this leak. Now I check inside to make sure nothing inside, but you can see the white frost from the refrigerant coming out. So outside I found a leak. I just want to make sure there's nothing up here. Uh, it's a little greasy. Hard to tell. That feels oily. Oh yeah. So let's see. Could be an old one. Or a new one. Leak detector. It's going. Diode warmed up. And did I leave my other light? Where? Probably in that. Oh well, I'll get it. Anything here look obvious, not really. The bottom. Okay. All clear. Come on, you're sampling the air. Good. It's definitely getting a whiff. Start in the back. Nothing. something
That makes it harder. <sighs> Clear. Let's go to where in here and they come back right there Every time on us. Yep. All right. Yeah, there's coils leaking off. So. <sighs> That's two leaks on the system, so you gotta check both. Don't wanna write one up and the other's leaking. Oh, I'm out. Till next time.